Why is his hair gray? Did he dye it? Like I know this is Japan where people have unnatural hair colors, but I don't care. I don't care anymore. This is it's a video game. And they're gonna question this guy's hair in the video game. All you can do right now is proceed forward. Gonna turn around. Alright, do you seek the truth? You heard someone's voice. The message is to be first person. It should be like, I heard someone's voice. Or, not, you heard someone's voice. It makes me feel like I'm one of those people who's snobby. If it's truth you desire, come and find me. The voice came from up ahead. I must feel compelled to find a voice. Hello. You sent someone beyond this door. Continue through. Whoa! Calm down there. Analog stick. <laughs> what if I clicked no? I should have clicked no. So, you're the one pursuing me. Hmm. Try all you like. It seems you can see a little despite the fog. Showing <laughs> fog. I'm gonna increase my defense. But, you will not catch me so easily. If what you seek is truth, then your search will be even harder. Is that gonna kill me? The surroundings are covered in fog. No, my defense! I'm losing consciousness. This is a dream. I'm already lost consciousness. What am I double losing consciousness? Leave me alone. Breakfast ready. Shut up. I don't want breakfast. I swear to God, if it's just plain old cereal, I'm gonna punch somebody. I'm gonna punch the dad. What's up, bitches? Good morning. Oh, are you preparing the breakfast? Toast. And eggs. Thanks. Okay, let's eat. Do you do the cooking? I can toast bread and cook sunny side up eggs in the morning. Dad can't cook, so I buy dinner. You can't cook. You're starting school today, right? No. My school's on the way, so let's go together. You want to hold hands? Am I going in the clothes I slept in? This game knows me better than I know, than I thought, because I do that in real life. I go to school in the clothes I sleep in. Saves time. That way, I don't have to change when I wake up. You keep going straight from here. Okay. My school's this way. Bye. Bye. Um, I'll see you tonight. School zone. It's 
intersection in front of the school. Nice. Need some help? You should leave him be. No, I should help him. Go back, you selfish asshole. Go back and help him. You ride right at the main gate of Yusugami High School. What kind of student life awaits you here? The same exact one in every Japanese anime slash video game. The exact same one. Uh, talk about bad luck. The homeroom teacher here is Moroko, isn't it? Oh, I yeah, hate Moroko. Moron, all right. We get to enjoy his long ass sermons every day for a whole year. Hey, you guys, I heard there's going to be a transfer student from the city in this class. Ooh. Huh? Really? A guy or a girl? I don't know. I hope it's a girl. A transfer <laughs> student from the city. Just like you, huh, Yosuke? Huh? You look dead today. Thanks. Yeah, um, I don't want to talk about it. What's with him? Who knows? All right, shut your traps. I'm Kinshiro Moraoka, your homeroom teacher from today forward. First things first. Just because it's spring doesn't mean you can swoon over each other like love struck baboons. Long as I'm around, uh, you students I'm stretching are pure and yawning as the driven at the same snow. time. I'm sorry. Now, I hate wasting my time, but I'd better introduce this transfer student. This sad sack's been thrown from the big fuck city yourself, out to the fuck. middle of nowhere. <laughs> this by sad sack, uh. And he's just as much of a loser here as he was there. So you girls better not get any ideas about hitting on him. Tell him your name, kid, and make it quick. You calling me a loser? <laughs> That's it. You're on my shit list. Now go fuck yourself. You're on my shit list. Now listen up. This town is miles away from your big city of perverts and assholes in more ways than one. You better not even think of getting involved with the girls here, let alone abusing them. It's, whoa, well, whoa, whoa. Where did that it's come not from? Like the old days. Even here, kids grow up so damn fast. Every time I turn my back, you're fooling around on those damn phones, checking your life journals and your my places. And fucking around with news and dick pics. Uh, excuse me, is it okay if the transfer student sits here? Oh, she wants the D. Huh? Yeah, sure. You hear that? Your seat's over there. So hurry up and sit down already. She wants me. Oh yeah, I'm gonna give it to her. I'm gonna give it to her right in the middle of this classroom. He's the worst, huh? Rotten luck for you to get stuck in this class. Well, we'll just have to hang in there for a year. You can hear people around you talking about you. <laughs> Sucks to be the transfer student, ending up in King Moron's class on the first morning here. Yeah, he won't think twice about suspending you if you get on his bad side. Then again, we're all in the same boat. Shut your traps! I'm taking roll, and I damn well expect you to respond in an orderly manner. <laughs> School's done already? Wow. That was fucking fast. That's all for today. Sorry. Normal lectures will start uh, I tomorrow. Need to, I need to start blowing my nose before I do this. Attention all teachers. Please report immediately to the faculty office for a brief staff meeting. 
All students must return to their classrooms and are not to leave the school until further notice. Ugh. You heard the announcement. Don't go anywhere until you hear otherwise. He's seriously getting on my nerves. Well, what are you going to do about it? Stop talking near me. Go away. Did something happen? Don't those sirens sound really close? Ah, I can't see a damn thing. Freaking fog. Fog? Shit, like every time it rains, the other like guy it gets from my fog. dream. He used hey, fog did you hear? to I kill me. Paparazzi's looking all over for that announcer. Oh huh, yeah. You mean my Yumi Yamano, right? I heard some guy spotted her at the shopping district. Actually, I heard that. Are you serious? Rumor loving student? Is that his name? Hey, hey Yukiko-san. Mind if I ask you something? Um, do, is it true that do you put out? staying at your family's inn? I can't discuss such things. So that's a yes. Yeah, I guess not. <sighs> Sheesh, how much longer is this gonna take? There's no telling. <sighs> I should have left before the announcement came on. By the way, did you try what I told you the other day? You know, that thing about rainy nights. Oh. No, not yet. Sorry. Oh, that's okay. Well, it's just... I heard a guy in the class next door yell something like, My soulmate is Yamano, the announcer. Attention, all students. There has been an incident inside the school district. Police officers have been dispatched around the school zone. Please stay calm and contact your parents or guardians as soon as possible and quickly leave the school grounds. Do not disturb the police officers. Head directly home. I repeat. Incident? What, something actually happened? Come on, let's go take a look. Sorry I'm being so quiet. It was just uh Hey, are you I had nothing to say about what was going on. And I was just us? listening to what was Oh, nearly forgot. I'm to what they were saying. Tanaka. You know I sit next to you, right? Of course. Well, nice to meet you. Uh, this is Yukiko Amagi. Oh, nice to meet you. I'm sorry that this is so sudden. Come on, don't apologize like that. It makes me look like I've got no upbringing. I just wanted to ask some stuff. Really, that's all. Uh, um, Miss Satanaka, this was really awesome. Like, the way they moved was just amazing to see. And I'm really sorry. It was an accident. Please just have mercy until my next paycheck. See ya. Thanks. <laughs> Stop right there. What did you do to my DVD? Ah. Oh. What the? I can't believe this. It is completely cracked. My trial of the dragon. Limited edition signed by the director. Critical hit to the net. Uh, are you all right? Now his balls just went up his pelvic area. His balls just ascended. He's fine, Yukiko. Let's ditch him and go home. Let's hang out with this new guy and go have a threesome with him at our house. Yeah! He looks like he's in a lot of pain. You should leave him be. <laughs> Hey, that guy has gray hair too. Oh no, he doesn't. Strange you student. Go hang out somewhere. What? Who, who are you? Get away from me! Help, police! What's up with him? What school's he from? Never mind that. He's going for Yukiko-san. Man, you'd think he'd at least wait until she's alone to make his move. We can hear you. Tap, he gets knocked out. 
No bet. Haven't you heard how difficult the Amagi challenge is? You, we can hear you. We're not that far from it. Oh, you, we can, we can so hear you. Are, are you coming or not? I, I'm not going. Fine. You're way too aggressive, dude. You gotta be. You gotta be. You know, smooth. You, you gotta be nicer. What did he then want? you get me. Obviously, he was asking you out on a date. Huh? Really? You really had no clue? Shh. But then again, that was way over the top. It was creepy how he called you Yuki all of a sudden. Yo, Yukiko-san. Turned down another lovelorn fool, huh? Man, you're cruel. You got me the same way last year. I don't recall doing that. Well, are you serious? So then you want to hang out sometime? I'd rather not. That'll teach me to get my hopes up. Anyways, you two better not pick on the transfer student too much. We're just curious is all. Bye, curious. Ooh. I'm sorry for dragging you into this. Come on, let's go. Everybody is staring. Hi, everybody. I'm just going to wave to all of them. Is that old guy again? Oh, so you came here because of your parents' job? <laughs> I thought it was something way more serious. There really is nothing here, huh? Well, that is what makes it nice, but there's nothing much we can show to people from outside. Oh, though there is something from Mount Yasagami. I, I think our dyed clothes or uh, pottery or something is kind of famous. Oh, wait, there's the Amagi Inn. Yukiko's family runs it. It's the pride of Inaba. Huh? It's just an old inn. Don't be so modest. Oh, no way. It's been in all sort of magazines as a hidden treasure. It's a great inn. It's been going for generations, and Yukiko here is going to take over someday. The inn actually attracts a lot of visitors to Inaba. It pretty much keeps this town going. I don't think that's entirely true. So tell me, you think Yukiko's cute, huh? Damn right I do. <laughs> I knew it. Come on, don't start this again. She's really popular at school, but she's never had a boyfriend. Kind of weird, huh? Nothing wrong with that. Come on, stop it. I'm 20 years old and I never had a girlfriend. You shouldn't believe that, okay? It's not true that I'm popular or that I've never had a boyfriend. She's had plenty of boyfriends. Wait, no, no, no. What I meant to say was I, I don't need a boyfriend. Well, she wants Jeez. a boyfriend. GA. <laughs> Sorry. Sorry. But this is our chance to talk to somebody from the big city and you barely said a word. Hey, what's that? So that high schooler left school early, and as she came down this street... Wow, who could imagine that hanging from an antenna? I wanted to see it too. Oh, you got here too late. The police and fire department took it down just a moment ago. Well, I think it's terrifying. I can't believe a dead body showed up around here. Wait, what did she just say? A dead body? Looks like we got a murder mystery. Hey, what are you doing here? Did something happen? I was just curious. We're just passing by. Huh. I should have figured that had happened. That damn principal. We told him not to let them through here. You know this guy? I'm Detective Dojima, his guardian. Uh, well, how should I say this? I hope you get along with him. If you know what Chief I mean, Sling really wink, ought to wink. stop wandering around nudge, and head nudge. straight home. Adachi, how long are you going to act like a rookie? 
You want to be sent back to the central office? Uh, I'm sorry. <clears throat> go wash your face. We're gonna go around and gather information. <gasps> was this what that announcement was about? What do they mean? It was hanging from the antenna. Dead body. Dead body was hanging from the antenna. Hey, Yukiko, why don't we go to Juness some other time? Good idea. All right, then. We're taking off. Starting tomorrow, neighbor. Let's do our best. All right. I'm down with that. The two of them left. We decided to head straight home. So when do I actually get to control my character? Looks like it's just me and you again. I all wonder alone. if Dad's not coming home again tonight. Don't worry, I'll look after you. Our uh, top story this evening concerns a bizarre case in a quiet suburb. Around noon today, a woman was found dead near the Samegawa River in Inaba. The deceased has been identified as Miss Mayumi Yamano, a 27-year-old announcer at the oh, local no. television station. Sorry. The initial results of the Inaba Police Department's investigation have revealed... <laughs> the, the, the Inaba Police Department! That's where Dad works! <sighs> Are you worried about him? Uh-uh. It's his job, so things like this happen. The body was found hanging from a large television antenna atop a local resident's roof. Authorities are uncertain as to why the body was in such a state. With the cause of death also uncertain, police continue to investigate whether the death is an accident or a this, homicide. Uh, this a thick hunter fog is giving a lot of information. has slowed their progress, and plans to fully canvas the area are delayed until tomorrow. Y'all can read. Y'all know what that says. I'm not gonna patronize you. The roof? That's scary. <gasps> oh, it's Juness. Oh, now she's happy again. Juness. Every day is Customer Appreciation Day. Come see for yourself and get in touch with our products. Every day's great at your Juness. Stop Every it. Every day is great at your Juness. Deja vu. You're a good singer. <laughs> I'm the best one in my class. You gotta compliment them. <laughs> 